I just got down with the uh, silence, no silence, no more. I guess rally where we support the local law enforcement. It was pretty good. We stopped by Travis County, well, Williamson County Constable Office first. They hit Round Rock Police Department. Had some officers show up there. It's pretty awesome. Then we came to Round Rock. Uh, correction, we came to Pflugerville Police Department. But that's why I'm leaving now. So our guys are going to get some lunch. I'm gonna go ahead and head home. Reason being is I actually had a slight mishap on my bike. While turning the corner, just like I just did just now, I end up uh, hitting up against the curb and my foot got caught between my bike and the curb. So, this is a good thing I'm wearing boots because I got a nice little skid mark along that, uh, along that curb. A little scratch on my uh, engine guard and a small, well, a couple of small scratches on my floorboard on the right side. As you can see, my foot right there, that's why I wear boots. So the only bad thing is, uh, once the bike stopped, it was leaning over on against the curb and my foot was between the curb and my bike. And of course, this is an 800 pound bike, so I heard I couldn't get it up, get it off, uh, and my foot wasn't actually touching the the ground, so I couldn't use that to push up, to push the bike upright. So thank for another ride was right next to me. They got off, and I was pointing, and indicating that uh, I, my foot was caught, and they were able to just upright the bike a little bit, and I was able to get my foot out. So it's a little sore. I don't think anything's broken. It's just, uh, the weight from the bike, but the amount of time that was on there is probably about good. I said probably about 30 seconds. Uh, so it's gonna be swollen. I'm gonna go home put some ice on it Chill out for the rest of the day And it should be good to go by the time we get back to work So we got the Fluverville Police Department uh, They were gonna be there they had said they would have tents and everything set up and meet the officers But we got there there was nobody there And I used to be with this department, so one of the Texas actually drove up and said, Hey, what are you guys doing here? It's like, and I explained, Well, we're here for the uh, support the law enforcement. And he informed me that they were working a, a critical incident, and that's why they weren't anybody there. And of course, today is Saturday, so may not be as many officers on the shift right now, so they're all being occupied right now dealing with that critical incident, so it's understandable. But it was a good ride. I'm gonna post the uh, videos from it, some pictures. And of course, I haven't been uh, riding that much lately. But I'm gonna try to get out more, do some more videos. Still got some other stuff I'm gonna do on my bike uh, that I haven't done yet. So I'm probably gonna go order my lower fairings. Give you guys some input on that. Uh, and a tour pack. I'll probably do a tour pack more towards the, the fall so it's get cooler because I'll probably start once this COVID thing kind of subsides and hopefully gets under control we better do this some more uh, event riding. Take my wife with me and see how that goes. So hopefully everything works out with that and this COVID thing would uh, get better. So it really definitely changed everything. So surges were definitely out of question this year. Uh, Maybe next year I might decide to go ahead and just uh, make that leap and hit Sturgis for the first time. So, anywho, well that's all for now guys. Like I said, uh, it was a good day today. Uh, the site's my slight miss out, but that's why you want to wear protective gear guys. Uh, helmet and everything, so I'm good to go. If I would have had tennis shoes on, I probably would have lost some skin today. I'm off the top of my foot. Alright, till next time guys, peace.